you have heard about the sea pirates in the Gulf of Siam. Because both people came to first countries of asylum, Thailand, Malaysia, Singapore, Indonesia, Philippines. And on their way, they met with sea pirates that robbed them of everything, who killed them, who violated the women and even very young children. And when you hear the reports about young girls of 12 or 13 years old raped by pirates, you get very angry at them. You might think that if you have a gun, you like to shoot these pirates in order to save the children. But if you look more deeply, you see that shooting the pirate would not help because the pirate is an effect that has been brought about by many causes. One night I meditated on that and I saw myself as a pirate, non-duality. Suppose 30 years ago I was born in a fishing village near the coast of Thailand and if I had a drunk father, a mother who knows nothing about raising children, I had no school, I, I only play with the delinquent children. And then when I grow up and become a ignorant uh, fisherman, I will be drawn into that business of being separated very easily. Life is very hard. And a friend come and tell me that, well, you only need to do once and get a little bit of gold or money and then your life will be easier because nobody has taught me to love, to understand. That is why I follow the advice. I became a separate. And if you shoot me, you cannot help me. Because last night or tonight, this very night, there are many hundreds of babies born along the coast of Thailand. And if we do not do anything for them, the economists, the politicians, the educators, and the other living beings. If we don't do anything for them, and then in 25 years, many of these babies born tonight will become separates. This is like that. That is why that is like that. So nobody can claim to be innocent. So a Bodhisattva, an enlightened person, when he looks at the separate, he can understand and he can love even the sea pirates. I myself, if I was born there with the same conditions, I might have become a sea pirate. So when you see like that, you stop blaming. And you know that the only way is to help. In that case, your anger vis-à-vis -vis the sea pirate will vanish. Concerning our governments, sometimes we get very angry because our governments do not have the kind of policy that we wish they would have in order to bring about reconciliation and peace. We have to practice the same kind of looking why they are like that. After government, they behave very much like each other. There are those who say that if I can be in the government, I will do differently. But I think that is not very likely to happen because our society is built in such a way that any government could do more or less the same thing. And our degree of awakening, our way of life, is the root of everything. If we know that it is impossible to remove this without removing this, and then the hope to remove only the bombs is naive. To remove only the bombs and retain the rest, that is a very naive hope. Because the bombs are the fruit of the tree. And if we don't look at the tree and the roots, we are going to have more bombs. So anger vis-à-vis -vis the government does not help. Anger does not help in any case. 
Violence always leads to more violence.